It's been one year now after Harvey. Thousands of families are still working to rebuild. Many of them are getting help from organizations like the United Way and Baker Ripley. Joining me now is Anna Babin, the president and CEO of the United Way. Anna, good to see you. Good morning, Cambrell. Well, what uh, an interesting year we've had. It's been a phenomenal year. It's been one of uh, great highs and great lows and everything in between. But here we are one year later. And for those people who may not know, I mean, United Way is ever present in a lot of things. But there's so many times when we get times of peril like we had during Harvey, that's when the United Way and the United Way organizations really step up. Right. Well, one of the things we are very proud of and what, what we hope hope the community would know is that we provide the most accurate information. Our 211 Texas United Way helpline is there 24-7 and uh, individuals calling. We had over 400,000 calls mm -hmm. in about disaster related and it's the place to go uh, for where's the shelter, where can I get food, I need disaster case management and so people who are still in need should call 211. Now, you talk about that and Baker Ripley is one of those organizations that rose to the occasion Absolutely. when it was needed, when a lot of people were trying to find a place. You talk about shelters. Um, they really stepped up, and as a result, they were really uh, rewarded in a lot of ways because of their performance during Harvey. Absolutely. One of the things we do is uh, uh, is coordinate the long-term recovery, and Baker Ripley is one of those key partners at the table, helping us with case management, minor home repair, really unmet needs, and so one of our strong, strong partners, Baker Ripley. And and the help, the fund that you set up after Harvey was specific. It was different from the normal United Way campaign. Absolutely. Right? We had to suspend our annual campaign for about eight weeks and stay totally focused on fundraising for Hurricane Harvey. Very happy to say we secured over $51 million, for, restricted specifically to help people recover. And, Cambrell, this is a three- to five-year process. Mm -hmm. It's mm -hmm. long-term. Just because it's one year, people think, the, the communities back together. Some are, but some are not. Yeah, I remember while this was going on last year, I was going through my 25th anniversary of Hurricane Andrew. Oh. And I remember how long that took, and I tried to let people know. So yes. we continue to have that going on. So now, you still have money in the fund? We do, and the reason we do is that we hold out to leverage those dollars with the federal funds. So we're waiting for the community development block, block grant money to come in so that we can stretch the money and help more people. That is a great thing you do, and I know that it's a good reason for people to be aware that when you contribute to United Way, you contribute to our community and Absolutely. when we need it the most. So. Absolutely. And it's always good to see you do great work. Thank you, sir. And I, I, nonprofit work I do, I run into her all the time, yes. and I'm glad to say that we are, 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 are I seem to see you in good places when we're doing good work. Absolutely. So I appreciate you Thank you, you Cambrell. Uh, so if you can, if you want to find information and replay on this segment online, you can do that on clicktohouston.com. After the show, it'll be posted under the video tab on the homepage. We'll be right back after this.